Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how some websites can use JavaScript codes in their source code to find out whether you are currently logged into Gmail, Twitter, Facebook or Dig. I'm using Google Chrome but the same method works in Firefox, Safari, Internet Explorer as long as the JavaScript is turned on. So let's quickly check how this thing works. Uh, to test this JavaScript onload event, you will need to go to this website. If you are watching this video on YouTube, check the video description for the link. So as you can see, the status that's being shown is that no, I'm not logged into my Gmail account. That's shown in red. And when I scroll down, it shows that I'm not logged into Twitter and Facebook as well. Now I will clear my browsing history and delete all the cookies. Now I'll reload the page again to see what's the status that that is being thrown. The same status is thrown that no, I'm not logged into Gmail. In fact, I'm not in, logged into Gmail. But let's scroll down and see the status. Yes, it shows that uh, I'm not logged into Twitter and Facebook as well. Now what I will do, I will quickly log into all of these accounts and see that whether the web page can track my login status. So I've logged into all these websites. Now I'll return to that page and reload it to trigger the event. Yes, the status has changed. So it has changed from red to green and shows that uh, yes, you are logged into Gmail. So it can track whether I have logged in or logged out of Gmail. And when I scroll down, I see yes, you are logged into Facebook and you are logged into Twitter as well. So to check the authenticity of the script, I will just log out from my Facebook account and keeping Twitter and Gmail intact and reload the event again. So I logged out of Facebook and I will reload this page again. Showing that uh, yes, I'm logged into Gmail, but uh, when I scroll down, uh, it shows I'm logged into Twitter but not into Facebook. So you see, the, the script can track whether you are logged in or logged out. So I logged out of Gmail and loading the page again will show that um, I have logged out of Gmail. Yes, that's it. So I'll log out of Twitter again reload the page the status will change of course so all three status are logged out yes so as you can see the website can track that uh, whether the, your current logging status and uh, this guy is using an image uh, this long image embedded in his source code he gave as an example so I'll copy this and uh, open the image in a new browser tab but uh, you can't see the image while you are logged out so you need to log in to see that image so I will log in again so I logged in again and I will close all these browser tabs and uh, I will use that image that's the image so this I guess this is the uh, image used in his account picture and the image is public of course otherwise you couldn't see it so the thing is this guy is using an image in his gmail account and using a javascript onload event to track it well that's it uh, thanks for watching